Chris Hinkle with CR Sotheby's International Realty. Today I wanted to talk with you about living in Truckee in the winter time. Now this is not an average year, but no year is average anymore with global warming. Some people have been out of power for days. We were out of power for, oh, about 13 hours, I think, last week, but that wasn't too bad. Some people have been out for four or five days, especially around Donner Lake and now some areas up in Tahoe Donner have been at without power for a few days. You could have a backup generator and that could run your house or at least potentially some lights in your refrigerator. Now some of the things that you're going to want to survive are obviously a heat source. A wood burning fireplace is fantastic. If you have a gas one like ours, we have the, the pilot light going and can turn it on and that'll throw out some heat. Now you're gonna to wanna to make sure you have enough medication and enough pet food and medication for your pets and potentially litter if you have some of these running around your house. Most people around here have a driveway plowing service where they come and they'll plow your driveway once or twice a day during the winter and it's usually $800 to $1,200 or it could be a lot more if your driveway is a lot bigger. Everybody, even if they have a driveway plowing service, they should have a Honda snowblower, at least a seven horsepower Honda snowblower. And in addition to that, we even have a little electric snowblower that we use on our decks, which is really handy because then you don't have to drag the gas snowblower through the house to get to the back decks. You're gonna to wanna to make sure that you have a couple of good snow shovels. And this is a snow hoe, which is an excellent tool to get snow off of your car without scratching the paint. If you're gonna live here full time, or even spend a fair amount of time up here in the winter, you're gonna want a four wheel drive vehicle. Now, all wheel drive vehicles aren't nearly as good as four wheel drive vehicles. You're gonna want a four wheel drive vehicle with a lot of clearance. You're gonna to wanna to make sure that your four wheel drive vehicle has snow tires on it, not all season tires. Now, here's a picture of my husband's truck. It was completely cleared free of snow day before yesterday. There's more than twice this amount of snow at higher elevations up in Tahoe Donner and up on Donner Summit. You're gonna to wanna to have a couple extra gas cans for that, fill up that snow blower or to fill up your vehicle. If, if you know a storm is coming, you wanna to top off all of your gas cans, top off all of your vehicles, all your gas powered equipment, just in case the gas stations run out of power or out of gas. As far as the internet goes here in the Truckee area, the main provider is Suddenlink. If we're out of power, you might be out of internet for many days in a row. If the power goes out and you don't have a generator, you're gonna to wanna to have some extra lighting for sure. It's always good to have extra batteries. We have those solar puff lights, which are really good, but if it isn't sunny, if it's snowing for several days in a row, those are only gonna last a limited amount of time. You're also gonna to wanna to have some battery powered lights. Right now, the Central Sierra Snow Lab has recorded almost 200 inches of snow which is pretty much 20, I think it's 25 inches more than the record. So we are at record setting territory. And so I don't mean to be a doomsday preparer, but I just think you should prepare for the worst and hope for the best. You know, bring some books to read. You can have some animals, pet your cat, do some snow shoveling. Life is too short. You should just go and love it all up. My name is Chris Hinkle. I'm with Sierra Sotheby's International Realty. If you want to give me a call about living in this area in the mountains or or anything else in this area i'd be happy to help you i've lived here most of my life and i know it pretty well my number is 530-412-2644 i look forward to hearing from you